Hey YouTube, um, I just wanted to do a updated video because it's been a long time since I did a video with my hair out and um, I really have been focusing on the products that I'm using and I've been trying to grow my nape area out. Um, it's been probably six or so months that I've been really going hard, you know, picking products that um, would help my hair grow more stronger. Um, probably three, maybe four months ago, I took, I cut off about three or so inches. And um, I noticed that my hair has been growing way faster since I've been dusting my edges, I mean not my edges, dusting my my um, ends or whatever. So I've been putting um, Jamaican black castor oil and this um, raw shea butter that I've been using on my hair. And as you can see, there is some length to it. Let me see if I can get a little bit closer where it wouldn't get so out of focus on my phone but it's really growing and I cut my whole entire head like I said probably four months ago um, I figured that I would probably um, cut it maybe every three or so months that I would trim my ends and I've been keeping it braided into um, box braids like that one on this side and one on the other side and I've been growing out my edges as well because I notice a lot of women have been talking on here about their edges because that's something that's really been like an issue for some people um, I noticed since I went natural um, probably a year and a half ago um, where I normally didn't have to relax my hair, but like every six months or so when I did, but I have been natural for over a year. This is how much hair came out just from combing out that dead hair. Um, these braids has been in for about two or so weeks. And all I've been doing is washing my hair with this Avon Naturals hydrating conditioner. Hope you can see that and it's a coconut kind and I've been using the conditioner as well and I've been putting this shea butter whenever I take the braids out um, I keep normally keep them in for two weeks and then I take the braids out um, I've been putting this on it completely all over the hair and I also been using this my Jamaican black castor oil that I purchased on eBay for like $8.99 when they sent me the bottle it broke and they were nice enough to send me another bottle so I have two so I've been putting that all over the hair and then you know either twist sometimes I twist it to take a break sometimes I braid it and then I'll take it out and then I'll twist it up or whatever because the twists do hold as long as the hair is nicely moisturized it'll hold or whatever and I just uh, twist it up like that and then twist it at the bottom and then I'll leave it alone as you can see from the twist how long it is when you twist it because you stretch you stretch the hair but because my hair is moisturized and like for my edges I just braid up two braids around the perimeter and from here because I'm not going to take these out you can see the length kind of I think I'm going to do another video where I'm going to take my hair out and then you can see how long my hair actually is because the only hair video that I've ever done was like the apple cider vinegar video 
um, because I do try to do that like once a month and I've been taking a break on that and I've been focusing more on keeping my hair moisturized and letting it sit for sometimes a month or whatever I do deep condition every two weeks and I do co-wash once a month so I don't rob my hair of all the oils that I've been putting on it because it's been growing a lot it's like every two weeks when I take my hair out it seems like it's grown so much um if you let your hair sit sometimes that depends on how your hair get because I have a very dry scalp and my scalp is very dry so I have to constantly moisturize my hair um regularly to keep it from drying out I live in California and the sun is really really like <sighs> Like I've said in many videos, beams like nobody's business. Um, and my hair tends to get dried out quite a bit. So, you know, that's just an update on, you know, what products I'm using um, for my hair. And if there, you know, anybody requests, I will put it in the description bar for right now. Um, trying to get myself together. Um, I have a little birthday party thing to go to for a friend of mine and I just wanted to do that real quick um I've been watching Jamaican makeup artists and she was saying quite a bit about her edges and stuff and it's like I have like a lot of hair on my edges because I really really been taking care of my edges and the back of my hair because I want my nape area to grow um as much as it can um, I notice a lot of people do neglect the back of their hair and that's one of the main reasons why their hair in the back is not growing because they're not um, keeping it moisturized and when I do braid it I don't braid it really tight either because my scalp is very sensitive so I'll get bumps but anywho I need to get back to doing my makeup I'm um, having like a really really crazy issues right now with my eyebrows um, trying to get them to match up or whatever so I need to re you know get on to applying my foundation and stuff and get my butt out of here um hope you guys have a very Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year if I don't post a video for New Year's it's your girl Miss Chocolate and have a wonderful day